Mount Washington Sewer and Drain Cleaning. We're at 55 Bema Street, Berlin, New Hampshire. We just removed a, a clog that had wipes in it, uh, some dental floss, and a bunch of toilet paper that was in behind that. A little bit of root in there. I didn't pull any of the root back, but it's just growing in towards the end, so it's not really causing any problems right now. Uh, probably in a few years, it'll have to be uh, flex shafted out, cleaned out. Um, but we're going to perform the inspection back. The pipe is in relatively really good shape. The city connection is in good shape, except for a little bit of tree root in there, which is typical. It's like getting a haircut every now and then once needed. And uh, the rest of the pipe be, uh, behind this is just PVC all the way back to the clean out. And there was no sags, and that was in excellent condition. So we're going to perform the inspection back from the city tie-in towards the clean out which is located in a little closet just to the right of the washing machine located to, near the water meter it's going to turn that cold water on Keep the yeah. heat down. Yeah, can do that pipe. Winter will cause the uh, the sewers to steam up. Oh yeah. And it can cause it to because the heat's coming up. Oh yeah. So the cold water will drop the temperature inside the pipe and keep the steam oh, down. Do yep. It'll keep a clear picture. First time I called you yesterday, I didn't wait until until your answering machine picked up. And the second time I called you, I waited and I said, I'm not going to call you back unless you leave a message. Yep. <laughs> I think you must have butt dialed me because you called me at like quarter of six in the morning. This morning? Yep. This morning? This morning? Yep, this morning it rang once and. Yeah, I must have. It's a clock. I was pretty ready to go to work. Yeah, sometimes that happens. And then I'm like, oh my god, I can't fall back to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, it happens. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> the ones that I get mad at is when they, they call, they don't leave a message, and they call right back. And then they don't leave a message, and they just call right back, and they just keep doing that. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, the second time I, I said, I'm going to wait, wait to leave a message and it's a good thing I did. Yeah, I get a lot of spam calls. Oh, it's terrible. And they're coming through with local numbers, they're coming through with cell phone numbers, they're coming through with my own self, my uh, own home number. Right. That, that's what happened to Kevin the other day. You got a call from himself. And I'm always like, do I answer that? Is that me from the future? <laughs> do I need to know something? <laughs> Oh yeah, that's just like, just like Kevin. He called himself. I ain't answering that, is it? And they're all overseas ones coming in too. You still got a, I called your, your house line, is that still running? Yep, they all ring right to my cell phone. Oh, does it? Yep, I have them all forwarded. Oh. I really wish that your cell phone number could be your landline number. Yeah. Because then I can get rid of like 140 bucks a month. Yeah, exactly. Because we got a we got a landline too, only because my wife, a couple of my wife's aunts are really old, and yep. that's what they call them. But otherwise than that, all you get is. I don't understand how like Fairpoint and all those things, those phone companies, haven't gone over to cell phones because landlines are basically they're obsolete now yeah i can understand if they keep them around for the older people but then you got to have like a cutoff point right i know like i said that it, it, we get 10 calls a day 
We don't answer. Got an answering machine, right? Mean between go, 30 and 70. Oh, unreal. Because I got three numbers. Oh, okay. So, yeah. plus all my advertising. Right. So not only do I get the vehicle warranty stuff, I get the people for the your Google listings, your search engine stuff. Yeah, they were uh, they home to, advisor. They wanted to talk to me about my student loan the other day. Oh. <laughs> I'm 62. Be like, yeah, I'd like to return that for a refund. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 62, yeah, okay. Yeah, and your, your warranty, that too. the cleaning and the inspection. I like it. 